to Berylicious Kitchen. So today in Berylicious Kitchen, I will be doing buffalo wings. Yes, I'll be doing buffalo wings. So right here, I have my wings. I have my McCormick buffalo wings um, mixer and I have my seasonings. So before I get into it, please remember to like, share and subscribe. Tell a friend to tell a friend. Remember, subscription is free, so please subscribe. So let's get cooking. So first, I wash my chicken with vinegar. I clean them up, and I also cut them in pieces. Here, I have meat seasoning. All of these are half teaspoon. Half teaspoon of seasoning. Let me show you. Half. Half. I use the half teaspoon to measure all of these seasonings. You could use whatever season you like on your chicken. You season to your taste, but this is what I am using. So I have half teaspoon black pepper, half teaspoon garlic powder, half teaspoon onion powder, half teaspoon complete season, half teaspoon paprika, half teaspoon chicken season, half teaspoon um meat season so i make sure let me check let me double check to see if there's any more water on my chicken wing so i have just a little on it so i'm back now i'm gonna put all the seasoning on the chicken wing You can season this overnight if you really want the seasoning to soak into the chicken. I love to season my chicken an hour or two before I actually cook it, season it and put it back in the fridge. But for video purposes, I won't be doing it this time around. So I have seasoned the chicken wings with my seasonings of choice so remember you can always season to your taste use whatever seasoning you like to cook your chicken with so after i've done that now i'm gonna take the buffalo wings mixture the buffalo wing spices and then Oh, look at that. Look at that. Then I am going to. Oh, oh my goodness. Then I'm going to pour it over my chicken wing. And I will be baking these wings for 30 minutes in the oven. I already have my oven preheated to bake these wings. Oh, this smells so good, guys. This smells so good. So you mix it well, mix it well, guys. Mix it well. Make sure every piece of chicken wing is well coated. Let me zoom in. Let me zoom in and show you guys what's going on here. Look at that. So, this smells so good. So, so good. So, you're going to make sure that all the chicken wings are well coated. Well, well coated. Now, I am going to put these on a baking sheet or a file pan to bake in the oven. Whether you have the baking sheet, the file pan, you put it in there and then place it in the oven to 
bake. specific way how you place your chicken wings you just place them in the tin and make sure that everything fits properly oh these look so yummy wash this tin from yesterday so whenever you buy these in the supermarket or wherever you purchase them please wash them before you use them Always preheat your oven. So now I'm gonna let it bake for 30 minutes. So guys, this is the finish. Buffalo wings that I bake. I didn't fry them because I didn't want the extra oil, so I decided to bake them. So now I'm gonna put the sauce on it and toss it. Look at that. of the meat piece of the wing before I started to do this and let me tell you my mouth is on fire that buffalo season oh my goodness it is the bomb so now I'm gonna play this and let you guys see the finish
So guys, please remember to like, share, and subscribe. Tell a friend to tell a friend. Subscription is free, guys. Free, free, free. So while you're watching the video, just click that subscription button and give me a thumbs up. Leave your comment down in the comment section and tell me what next you'd like me to prepare for you guys. And tell me if you try this recipe, let me know you tried it. Or tag Berylicious Kitchen on Instagram. Look at this. Until next time, guys. Bye.